Hey, good morning, team. How's everybody doing? Getting things going uh, early today. I think one of the things that's really um, essential to any of the um, ability to kind of accomplish uh, your goals is, first of all, of course, they need to be clearly defined. What is it? that you want to achieve. Clearly defined goals create clear targets in which we can then produce clear actions to, to achieve them. Uh, I have a quote from Buckminster Fuller that is always kind of in the back of my head and it's, you can never change an existing reality by resisting the existing reality. To create change, you have to create a new model that makes the old model obsolete. And when we talk about the model, I'm talking about really what is the model of your day? How do you function in your day? Is it, is it a clearly defined action plan for you? Or are you randomly going about doing things? And generally, in doing that, what occurs is you deal with the urgent you'll find yourself running around, putting out the fires, responding to other people's needs. And doing that, in doing that, we get sidetracked from the essential actions that we need to take to move our agenda forward. So those things are really important. I always like to listen to some inspirational stuff in the morning. Generally, I get up, I drink some water, have a cup of coffee, say good morning to my wife, and I get back to my, to my own space. And I listen to something that's inspirational that kind of tries to set up my day. And then what I'll do is I'll go about taking care of the little things that I need to take care of in the house, in order to free myself up from those obligations. Now the day is mine. That's what works for me. The morning is, a, is an important time because I say, if you, know, if you don't get out of the gate, you'll never win the race. That's really kind of been very drilled into me through the athletics that I've done. If you never get out the gate, you'll never win the race. So inaction is the thief of opportunity. Inaction will steal your opportunity. It will leave you floating down the river of other people's demands, floating down the river of other people's demands. So I wanted to talk really about that. You cannot fight the existing reality of your life where you are right now. In order to make that change, you have to create a new model that makes that old model obsolete. What's that mean for you? What's that look like for you? And how do you go about doing that? If you want change, you can't do the things that you've been doing. There has to be change. There has to be things that you're doing differently. Going from an off season in athletics to being in the season of athletics. There's a change. 
things that you were doing in the off season are replaced with the things that you do during the season. The things that you did before you were a business owner, the way that you lived before you had these goals gets replaced with a new model of action that creates the change we're looking for. So those are some of the things that I think are important for us to realize. Those are the things that will allow us to move forward. So just a short talk. The best work you can do to create change is to work on yourself. Okay? Go out, make the world a better place, and may all good things come to you.